Well, new at six, grocery store outbreaks. As some businesses prepare to reopen, our I-team exposes cases of COVID-19 now growing at the supermarkets where you shop. Our Joel Grover has been on top of this story, and he joins us live now with some troubling new data. Joel. Well, Carolyn, we are learning of more and more supermarkets tonight where employees have tested positive. Also today, the Ralph's chain says it will not offer testing to all of its employees, contrary to a previous statement. This comes as the I-Team learns of 70 Southern California supermarkets, 70 of them where employees have tested positive for the virus. There are now at least 21 employees of this Ralph Sun Sunset who are positive for the coronavirus, up from 19 cases on Friday. Workers like Jackie Mayoral, who today was hospitalized for COVID-19. <laughs> employees like her were cheering last week when Ralph announced testing for all employees. I'm disappointed, even more than surprised. Disappointed because just three days ago, a Ralph spokesman said this to NBC4. Can any employee who wants to get tested get a test? Whether or not they're showing symptoms, they can take the test. Today in a phone call, he told the I-team, I apologize, I misspoke. He said Ralph's has the resources to give test kits to employees who have a medical need or are sick with symptoms in accordance with CDC guidelines. People who are not sick are spreading it. So if the goal is to stop the spread, you have to test asymptomatic people. According to the Grocery Workers Union, there are now 45 Ralph's stores with one or more employees who've tested positive. And Ralph's is not alone. At the Albertsons chain, which includes Vons and Pavilions, there are 26 stores with positive workers. One is this Vons on Las Feliz in Glendale, which the union says has had six positive workers. And there are other well-known stores, too, like this Bristol Farms in Hollywood, with at least five positive workers. Should all chains be offering testing to all employees? I believe so. I, I really do. I think if somebody's serving the public on a regular basis, we should make sure those people are not infectious. We asked Ralph's today to speak with us on camera. They declined our request. Also, Albertson's Vons Pavilions still has not responded to our emails. We did hear back just minutes ago from Bristol Farms. They tell us they have now thoroughly sanitized that West Hollywood store. Carolyn? Well, Joel, you mentioned those 70 local supermarkets with workers who've tested positive. So what's really the takeaway here for shoppers? Well, shoppers have to remember always to protect themselves and the workers in those stores. Wear masks, sanitize your hands, and keep a distance. Remember those safety steps every time you go into a store. Back to you. Yeah, good advice, Joel. Thank you.